Tennessee. Had a good off week. We started on them uh, Thursday. Had a good, good fundamental practice Tuesday and Wednesday. And got some recruiting done last week and uh, got, got a good start. I think it all starts offensively. Justin Worley, I think, is playing very well. Uh, completing over 60% of his passes, averaging about 250 uh, yards a game. Um, but they've really improved themselves at the receiver position. Marquez North and Jason Kroon are both 6'4 plus guys. They're very difficult matchups and coverage down the field. They take probably eight to ten shots in the game uh, down the field. You've got to defend these guys down the field. Uh, bigger guys that are, that are tough matchups. Pig Howard's a slot guy that's also played the X, has been made a lot of plays for him. Josh Malone's a freshman, has done a nice job. Josh Smith and Von Pierce were injured last week. I don't know what their status is for this week, but have all made plays in the passing game. So, you know, certainly I think the strength of their team uh, with, with Justin and their receiving core, uh, receiving wise, I mean, excuse me, running back wise, Jalen Hurd had over 100 yards last week, ran hard, tough, 6'3, 240 pounds, an instinctive guy, a very good football player. We recruited Marlon Lane's been there for a while. A uh, good football player and Ethan Wolf's done some nice things to tie it in. They have some new faces up front offensively, but certainly the strength of their team lies with their skilled people in the quarterback position. Defensively, uh, third down, they, they've got to be leading the country. They've only had three conversions in the last two weeks, uh, two against Oklahoma and one last week. So uh, they've done a nice job of getting off the field on third down, which has been an issue for us offensively and defensively. Uh, on both sides, which we worked on a lot in the open week. Uh, hopefully we've made some progress there. Uh, they're led by A.J. Johnson, who's a really good football player, instinctive, tough. He's around the ball a lot. Uh, he's played a lot of football for him. Kurt Majit's a good football player. Cameron Sutton's really caught my eyes a corner. A guy that runs extremely well, makes nice plays on the ball. Uh, but they're very good on special teams. We've got to get our guys ready for a noon kickoff in Knoxville. We'll be looking forward to it. Injury-wise, C.J. Wharton will be out. Leon Orr will be out this week. Hope to get him back next week. Mike Taylor with a knee and Brandon Powell with a hamstring are questionable to doubtful this week. And I uh, expect D.J. Humphreys to play. He'll practice today and he got some good work in last week and I feel like he'll be, he'll be ready to go. I hope 